Hello and welcome to La Swim Barbecue. Today I'm gonna make uh, some pulled pork. I've got two really small uh, pork butts. They're about two pounds each, just a little over perhaps. And uh, my plan is to, because it's uh, getting to be late in the day, uh, the plan is to let these cook on the ugly drum smoker for about two hours. And then I'm gonna bring them in and put them in the slow cooker and finish them off in the slow cooker overnight. Uh, and that's gonna be it. It's not gonna be very fancy. I'm just gonna see if there is any XXXXX fat on this that I should remove. And if so, I will. Uh, if not, we will know in a minute or two, won't we? Uh, if not, I'm just gonna season them and hang them in the smoker and let them get some smoke taste. These actually look pretty nice. That's a little bit of extra over here. I'm just gonna cut that off. I usually don't bother removing too much when I make pulled pork, but you never know, do you? Something like so. And well, there's a little bit of silver skin here. So I'm gonna season this with um, some regular seasoning. I've got um, tomato, basil, garlic, uh, pepper kind of thing. I'm gonna leave it like that. Um, I think that's gonna be good enough. Anyway, so I'm not gonna use the binder. I'm just gonna season them up. This is, smells really nice. Uh, I used this in another cook the other day when I made uh, the three ingredient cook off. And it was really, really good on pork. So I figured I could use it in pulled pork as well. Of course, the pulled pork is gonna be cooked in the slow cooker um, with some other spices and perhaps a beer or two or no, I don't know. I don't know if I have any beer. Anyway, I'll figure something out. Oh, we've got something that you've never seen before. Um, that's it. Uh, I'm gonna let the drum get up to temp and then uh, I'm gonna insert the hook Something like so, it's good. I'm probably gonna put on a little more seasoning right before I put this on. And then they're gonna hang there. But I'll bring you back when I'm by the cooker. I'll put it a little bit further in. I never did hang a piece of meat like this. So there we go. That's gonna be nice. At least I hope so. See you in a bit. Okay. Time to put the pork butts on. So I've got some hanging on hooks. I put a probe in each. I've got some smoke rolling and on they go. There we go. And this goes like that. And then we have a no peak situation for the upcoming hour or so. Okay, meet you back in a bit. Okay, so the pork butts have reached 160 almost internal uh, and that means that for me they're done out here i'm gonna take them off they look really nice actually or not actually they look really nice uh, i'm gonna take them off put them in a little dutch oven and then i'm gonna throw them in the oven and cook them in there for the coming four or five hours at uh, 300 degrees or so anyway i'll meet you back inside okay, there we go so we're just gonna put them in this small Dutch oven. I think that's gonna fit nicely. Just like so. I'm gonna have to move them around a little bit. And then we're gonna top that with some onion. And then I'm gonna use one bottle of uh, Hunt's original barbecue sauce. In it goes. And then we're gonna use something, like I said, you have never seen this before. Svagdrycka. This is from the time when they tried to make us not drink beer. So they made something that was distasteful and that wasn't beer. But it's really good for this. Anyway, this is gonna go into an oven for, I don't know, four or five hours until it reaches some good temperature. I'm not really sure when I'm gonna stop it. Anyway, um, just gonna get a lid on there and then 
it's going to go in into um, about 250 to 75 I changed my mind I think I'm gonna go there anyway uh, I'll meet you back in a couple of hours okay so it's been four hours just gonna test this yeah this is gonna pull apart time to pull it there we go it's got a really nice smoke ring and I'm just gonna take a little piece and try it out okay let's try this then mmm so tender lots of flavor still feel or I can still taste that mesquite that I had in the smoker um, I think the Hunts has given it the best taste this is gonna be nice um, it's like making a full meal of leftovers so I don't know what I'm gonna use it for but one of these days we're gonna have it for dinner thank you for watching bye mm -hmm.